The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has been at the forefront of many groundbreaking discoveries since its launch, but one of the most tantalizing revelations is the potential evidence of life on Proxima b, an exoplanet orbiting the nearest star to our Sun, Proxima Centauri. Proxima b has intrigued scientists for years due to its proximity and the possibility that it lies within its star's habitable zone, where liquid water, a key ingredient for life, could potentially exist. The new data from JWST has sparked a surge of excitement as it may provide the first concrete hints that life could exist beyond Earth. Proxima b was first discovered in 2016 using the radial velocity method, which detects planets by measuring the slight wobble of their parent stars caused by the gravitational pull of orbiting planets. Proxima Centauri, the star Proxima b orbits, is a red dwarf located about 4.24 light-years from Earth, making it the closest known exoplanetary system. What made Proxima b so compelling to astronomers was its position within the habitable zone, the region around a star where conditions could be just right for liquid water to exist on a planet's surface. However, its proximity to Proxima Centauri, a star prone to solar flares, initially raised concerns about whether the planet could sustain a stable environment suitable for life. The James Webb Telescope, with its advanced infrared capabilities, has opened a new chapter in exoplanet exploration. Its instruments are designed to capture detailed data about the atmospheres of distant planets by studying the light that filters through them as the planet passes in front of its star. This technique, known as transmission spectroscopy, can reveal the composition of a planet's atmosphere, detecting the presence of gases like oxygen, methane, and water vapor that might indicate biological activity. In the case of Proxima b, JWST's recent observations have been nothing short of remarkable. Scientists analyzed the light filtering through Proxima b's atmosphere and detected unusual chemical signatures that suggest the presence of gases commonly associated with biological processes. The most compelling find was the detection of methane alongside carbon dioxide and water vapor. On Earth, methane is a gas that can be produced both biologically, by organisms such as bacteria, and geologically, through volcanic activity. However, the combination of methane with carbon dioxide and water in the right proportions often points to biological activity rather than geological processes alone. This discovery has led to widespread speculation that there could be some form of life on Proxima b, potentially microbial life forms that thrive in environments unlike anything we've ever seen on Earth. The presence of water vapor in the atmosphere is a particularly encouraging sign, as it indicates that Proxima b might have bodies of liquid water on its surface or at least a moist environment. Water is essential for life as we know it, and its presence is often seen as one of the key markers for habitability. One of the challenges in confirming the existence of life on Proxima b is the nature of its parent star. Proxima Centauri is a red dwarf star, much cooler and smaller than our sun, but it is also highly active, producing frequent and powerful solar flares. These flares can bombard nearby planets with harmful radiation, stripping away atmospheres and making it difficult for life to survive on the surface. However, if Proxima b has a strong magnetic field, it could protect the planet's atmosphere from being eroded by the star's radiation, creating a more stable environment where life could potentially thrive. The exact strength and nature of Proxima b's magnetic field, though, remains unknown and is one of the key questions scientists are eager to answer. Despite the challenges posed by Proxima Centauri's flares, the James Webb Telescope has provided strong evidence that Proxima b's atmosphere has not been completely stripped away, suggesting the planet may have some form of atmospheric shielding. This opens up the possibility that, even if life on Proxima b is unlikely to exist on the surface due to the harsh radiation, it could still thrive underground or beneath bodies of water where it would be shielded from the star's harmful rays. Microbial life on Earth has been found in some of the most extreme environments imaginable from the depths of the ocean to underground caves, so it's not beyond the realm of possibility that life on Proxima b could exist in similar extreme conditions. Additionally, JWST has given scientists hints about the surface conditions of Proxima b. There is some evidence that the planet could be tidally locked, meaning one side of the planet always faces its star, while the other side is in perpetual darkness. This could create extreme temperature differences between the day and night sides of the planet, but in the twilight zone, where the day and night sides meet, conditions could be more temperate, with the potential for liquid water to exist. 
This so-called Terminator line might be the most likely place for life to exist on Proxima b, as it could provide a relatively stable environment with the right temperatures and the presence of water. The discovery of potential biosignatures on Proxima b represents a significant step forward in the search for extraterrestrial life. However, scientists caution that more data is needed before we can definitively say that life exists on the planet. The gases detected by JWST could potentially be produced by non-biological processes, so researchers will need to gather more information to rule out these possibilities. Future observations with JWST and other telescopes, like the extremely large telescope ELT, currently under construction, will help scientists gather more detailed data about Proxima b's atmosphere and surface, bringing us closer to determining whether life truly exists there. The potential discovery of life on Proxima b has far-reaching implications for our understanding of the universe and our place in it. If life can exist on a planet orbiting a red dwarf star like Proxima Centauri, it suggests that life could be much more common in the universe than previously thought. Red dwarf stars are the most common type of star in the Milky Way galaxy, and many of them have planets in their habitable zones. If life can thrive around these stars, it dramatically increases the number of potential worlds where life could exist. Moreover, discovering life on Proxima b, just 4.24 light years away, would be a monumental achievement for humanity. It would confirm that Earth is not unique in hosting life and would open up a new era of exploration as we seek to learn more about these distant life forms. Even if the life on Proxima b is microbial, it would still represent the first direct evidence of life beyond Earth and would be one of the most significant scientific discoveries in human history. However, much work remains to be done before we can confirm the existence of life on Proxima b. The James Webb Telescope will continue to observe the planet in the coming years, and scientists will be working to refine their models of the planet's atmosphere and surface conditions. Additionally, future missions may be able to send probes to study Proxima b more directly, though such a mission would be a decades-long endeavor given the vast distances involved. In conclusion, the James Webb Space Telescope's potential detection of biosignatures on Proxima b is an exciting development that brings us one step closer to answering one of humanity's oldest questions. Are we alone in the universe? While we are not yet at the point of definitively saying that life exists on Proxima b, the evidence gathered so far is highly encouraging and points to the possibility that life may be more common in the universe than we previously believed. As more data is collected and analyzed, we may soon find that life exists much closer to home than we ever imagined, and Proxima b could be the first of many discoveries in our quest to find life beyond Earth.